Hi guys, this video is for all my private lesson students. Um, as you know, uh, back about two and a half weeks ago, I did something to my knee. I was doing a gig in Arizona. When I got off the plane, I felt like my knee was gonna fall off. I have no idea what I did, um, but all I know is that it's a torn meniscus, torn ACL, and from the MRI, I have bone on bone on my left knee. That happened, same exact thing last year. I think just after the age of 50, According to our family's DNA, my knees are going to go out. You know, my mom has bad knees. Um, so anyway, um, it's been two and a half weeks. I had the stem cell injections done just three days after the incident, and it's already feeling great. It's not feeling awesome. It's not feeling amazing. It's feeling great. I can walk semi-normally now rather than limping around or limping with one leg straight, you know, so I don't move it, but I'm feeling there they're working in there and it's really, really awesome. But, um, I went to apprentice training last night because I, you know, I, I felt good. I thought, okay, I can teach a little bit, but I, there was a point in the training when I said, okay, I have to stop. I cannot dance right now. And you know, you get that feeling when something's wrong and you just, you, if you push it just one inch more, it's just going to completely fall apart. That's where it was. And I didn't want to push it. I wasn't even doing anything crazy. Um, I just said, wow, you know, I was hoping that I would be healed by in two and a half weeks, you know, from a torn ACL and, and a meniscus and I, my cartilage would already be grown back. But when this happened in 2016, um, to my right knee, it took about eight months to fully, fully recover. But I was already teaching privates within four, four months, four or five months. Um, and then doing beginners within like three. Okay. So right now. I can do a beginner class, you know, um, but not one-on-one -on -one intense privates like I do with you guys, you know, not for now. I don't want to push it. I don't want to make it any worse. I don't want to have to start over with this healing process. So I'm being super careful right now. Um, the great thing about this time off though is I'm able to spend some time on the uh, BBD curriculum. We already have senseis for um, Kizumba, Bachata, and Zook, which we're really excited about. Zook uh, by Sensei James Quinn Houghton in um, Australia and Sensei Fabian in Austin for the Kizomba and the um, Bachata curriculum. So they're doing those videos right now. We're revamping and, and redoing all of the current salsa, black belt salsa videos. and um, The curriculum is going to stay the same because it's really solid, but the videos are going to be amazing i'm videotaping them with the apprentices so it's all going to be organized by class you know what you do first second third fourth um it's not going to be you know try to find what you're looking for anymore it's going to be ex very explicit and so you know god works in mysterious ways and definitely um um the black belt program needed to be hugely revamped and i'm doing that right now so um this time is not wasted um and I'm going to come back stronger than ever. All right? You just wait. I cannot wait to let you know when all this is healed, really. And the amniotic stem cells, I did leave. If, if you wanted information, I left some info about Dr. Dean Jones at the bottom of this screen here. So you can give him a call if you know somebody. or They're the best. Um, I will trust him with my life. So anyway, um, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, please call me. And... Um, I cannot wait to get back there and work you hard. Okay? All right. This is Edith Salsa Freak signing out.